That's pretty much how my living room is set up right now. Mm. It's very claustrophobic. It's just blankets and pillows everywhere, bro. Yeah. Oh man, that's how you know. That's what that just means. It's just lived in. That's all. I'm it is. just the comfiest guy, bro. Yeah. I just I just refuse to not be comfy. Sometimes a lot of Ever. pillows and blankets is comfy. It's pretty nice. Although, it's pretty nice. If you have too many and they're not organized, you're just like sitting down on a bunch of shit that's not. It's chaos. No, it's chaos, bro. Where you just do one of these and fucking move everything. Yeah. And then sit down in between all the blankets and pillows. No, sometimes I'll just bundle them all up and then just like I'll I'll pretend that I'm just in a, a cave of blankets sitting on the couch, just in a pile. Yeah, the old, just with my just like E. T. when he's hiding in the dolls. Yeah, the old cave of blankets situation. Yeah, the old the old blanket cave. <laughs> it's like I don't El know. Cavo Blanco. There's a reason that like kids like to build couch forts and shit. Yeah, it's to hide from their moms when mm-hmm. they're drunk. It's like I'm I'm claustrophobic and I still like tidy tight little spaces like that. Yeah. So cause you're safe. It keeps yeah, it keeps the bad out. Yeah. Um like the the sheets really keep the bat out, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. That guy, like, dude, the guy who comes in with the like fucking baseball bat or whatever, he's not gonna know what to do. He sees a big fucking a couple of couches like tipped over, and he's gonna think somebody else already broke in and, yeah. and set up shop. Dude. <laughs> 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 he's, gonna be, he's gonna be like oh damn there's a professional here he's like i'm robbing this place for a couple months i'm posting up here dude i'm fucking good <laughs> that's a good strategy if you sit there and fucking just you find one house you stay there rob all the stuff while you're still there and then then le- then extract yeah <clears throat> Stay for a minute. Yeah. Just like in zombies, dude. It gets harder the longer you're there, though. Yeah. It does. Way harder. Yeah. It gets way harder to and leave. You lose the all your shit. You're if you there. die, if you die, you lose all your shit. Yeah. That's gotta be terrifying to have somebody break into your house, build a couch fort, and then have a police standoff. So I do do they have the standoff in the couch fort? Like the police are in the living room? <laughs> <laughs> Pointing the guns at the fort? It has to have happened. It has to have happened they somewhere. They warrant for the couch fort. There's got to be a story somewhere where somebody fucking <laughs> broke into... Well, just to live there, I guess. Maybe not to steal. But somebody's had to have broken into a house just to like... Some that happens guy. all the time. Yeah. That happens all the time. There's actually... um, uh, They send the cop officers after him, though? Running after well, him? sometimes the laws are fucked up. That happened to... Uh, and you're just allowed to stay there. Cause yeah, no, there's... Oh, he's been there for 20 minutes, so it, he can... He, legally, he can stay. Uh, <laughs> my sister's <laughs> my sister's boyfriend, his his mom owned a uh, 20 an Airbnb, and somebody uh, wouldn't leave. They, like, stayed and then Squires checked rights. out. Yeah, dude, they stayed and then checked out and then hid in the house. And it took them, like, luckily it wasn't one of those horror stories where they stay in there for years. I've seen shit like that, but she she was there for a few months. But, yeah, because it actually... um, What are they going to do? Pick you up and move you out of there? I I don't know. It's it's some weird archaic law, dude. Like, if somebody is squatting in your house... Like, my parents had this happen to them last year. If you find a good enough hiding spot... You're good. You're golden. 